Sadi will discuss with you some do-it-yourself skincare routines that every bride must have to have healthy and glowing skin. And in this video, I'm going to be discussing with you my favorite, all-time favorite exfoliation mask that you can make yourself at home. So we're going to talk about the first step that I would recommend um, to anybody and everybody who is going to be a bride to be is a exfoliation of the skin. It is so so important. Uh, my, I'm going to be telling you my favorite exfoliator that I make at home completely is called the coffee scrub. Coffee is, is such a great product for the skin. It helps in lowering inflammation. It helps with your under eye puffiness. It is great for cellulite removal. It has a acid called chlorogenic acid, which is the CGA. It also has a lot of antioxidants that help you fight radical damage to your cells. It tightens, it gives you glow, and it's just amazing for skin. This is what I do. I take two tablespoons of coffee. I add, I usually add caster sugar to my coffee, uh, two tablespoons again, but I'm out of caster sugar right now. So this is granulated brown sugar. I put that into it. After that, I take a little pinch of Himalayan salt, a little bit of it, and I add two pinches of baking soda. Okay, this is all that there is. Okay, uh, this is virgin coconut oil, and I'm putting about let's say a tea tablespoon. Okay, you just mix it, and if you want to get some real real nice smell to it you can definitely definitely add some vanilla essence to it or a little bit of cinnamon and this is one of the best scrubs ever okay so you keep mixing and mixing it till it becomes like this mm, yum it's like coffee so all i do is i take a little bit here and i start applying this on my face all right i start applying this on my face here and just look at that it blends so nicely and you can feel the coffee beans smell on your face so i would recommend all the brides to be guys exfoliate at least twice a week exfoliate in the evening not in the morning exfoliate and why i say that is because you know after exfoliation you are basically going to be putting your moisturizer or your night routine whatever that you do and you're not putting on any makeup after that so it makes a big big difference all right so you exfoliate rub 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 and i'm not putting it on my neck right now because the whole my clothes are going to go off uh, really dirty but you got to put it on your neck also and scrub it up for about 5 minutes gently, leave it for 10 minutes and then you take it off. So I'm going to remove this now. I've left, I just scrubbed my face for about 2-3 to three minutes and then I left it on for another 5 minutes because I was just loving the smell. Oh, nice and hydrated. Sugar has glycolic acid which is great for exfoliation. It's a na natural source of glycolic acid. And it is so great for the skin because it takes off your fur, dead layer on the top dead layer. Don't mind this, I got hurt, so it's not a uh, scrub. There, voila, nice. And can you see the pink on my face? I'm so pink because my I think this first layer of skin's come off completely. Okay, I'm good to go. Voila! So I highly recommend exfoliate your skin. Uh, do this um, twice a week or if you're feeling adventurous. Um, for especially with oily skin people, do it thrice a week at night and follow it up with your moisturizer um, and um, all the love that you can give to your skin. Hey guys, hit the bell icon and never miss a video from Shadivish.